Hello everybody, this is Out of the Box Unboxing and in today's episode I'm going to make a side-by-side -side comparison of two screwdrivers, two cordless drills as uh, IKEA claims of, uh, of Fixa screwdrivers, sc cordless um, uh, drills. First model it's uh, uh, 7.2, second it's 14.4. Uh, uh, those uh, model names are actually a uh, voltage, so 7.2 volts compared to 14.4 volts. First of all, uh, you can see what is the size difference of those drills. One is light, second is more heavy. This is uh, more than 1 kg. This is, in my opinion, uh, 0.7 kg. It's not mentioned uh, in, in, in the manual, but my, my impression is like a 0.6, maybe 0.7. So you can really feel the difference. So I would say for women, for, for men, uh, because in the long run you will be less tired. I mean, uh, using the smaller one. Uh, but it's the intended use is to help you screw your furniture. So. In my opinion, which we uh, manage better? This one. Please bear in mind that if you wanna, let's say, one time use thing, tool, you can invest those, I think 20 euros, something like that, for this. But I highly recommend add those 10 euros and buy something which will be more practical. Why? Uh, uh, I have made two videos uh, so, uh, let's say with separate test. So here I can make a comparison, but please bear in mind that uh, both of them have no uh, replaceable batteries. So in some way they are one time used, but still I think three, four years easily you, you can use them. So uh, if you think to, so I highly recommend you to invest additional 10 euros just to have some electric tool in your home because sooner or later you will need to screw something or, or drill something and with this tool you will not be able let me show you why first test let's try to drill a hole First difference, it has only 300 uh, RPMs. This baby has 1200 on the second gear. So this is the difference. Okay. And it's dying on spot, actually. can see hardly. You are able to drill something, but it's it's hard. It's not efficient. So for one second, it's uh, second gear, so it's fast. Sorry, it's a uh, uh, first gear. Slower, but still. And another gear. You saw the difference? And now let's try to screw some screws in. Again, I will start with the small, smaller one. I will put it on 10, the same with this I will do. Uh, this is a soft wood, but I think the harder wood will show better. Because, okay, furnitures from IKEA are not made from the solid wood. It's some kind of um, uh, composite, but still, uh, when you're drilling in soft material, you will not notice the difference. So, therefore, I'm using this harder, harder piece of wood. Thank you. 
it was on, on 10, 15, and it's not able to screw it down. You can put it on the drilling mode, but I'm not recommending to do it that, to do that. Second approach, uh, when you're screwing, not drilling, put it on the first gear, you will have uh, less RPMs, but uh, bigger, greater torque. So again, let's start from the 10, like here it was. And actually, on the 10th position, I have re uh, reached the same uh, effect like on 15 with that. So let's move to 15. Almost the same. So let's move to the maximum before drilling mode. And I was able to, to finish the job. Actually, what I have did right now, it was my mistake. But, but, there is a le uh, lesson for, for you. How to not screw uh, and to not make those mistakes in the future. When you are screwing or unscrewing, you need to be even you cannot move it aside i was trying to show it so i was let's say playing with the position of the of the drill and the effect is and the result is what you can see that the screw is damaged it actually also it will work but it's 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 damaged in in, in some way so in the long run, that's lost. But it's also a lesson for you how to do it properly. And I will now try to, to unscrew. Success. Okay, and some small quick summary, it's better to invest some money, really, 10 euros, it's making a difference. So, thank you for watching, stay tuned and see you next time, bye.